Monday. Happy MLK Junior Day, everyone. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, we're playing a little bit more Skyrim today. Hey, hey everyone. Uh, we are st still playing a little bit more with Arielia. There she is right there, looking beautiful. And, yeah, we're uh, going to be doing a lot more of the new quest today. Yeah, we'll wait for, give everyone a second to get rolling in here. I looked up a few more, and then I looked up some of the ones that I couldn't find before, like uh, Bitter Cup. So that's why we're in Fulcreath. Yeah, I'll give it, give it another minute. Yeah, I'm doing all right. How you guys doing? We had a uh, nice three-day weekend over here. Played played a little D and D, the usual, nothing too crazy. All right. So now this one is at the Dead Man's Drink is where this new quest is. There's also another new quest. Do I have? I might have stuff actually. I think I have stuff. We can hold a lot, but we might as well sell our sell our I stuff can't while we're here. We let provincials like you wander Skyrim. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. I just want to like burn that guy. Well met. I'm so Olaf. Take a look. That's so Olaf. Use my fire magic and burn him. Oh yeah, I got cool stuff. Oh yeah, I was gonna see if I can eh, magic damages. Oh yeah, this gets to go on a conjuring health. I think I have health already. Oh, and there we go. Got a drooly little baby. Hey everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are in Falkreath, and we're going to start some new quests. Shop and you'll regret it. Ah. Ah. We'll see. We haven't been too steely with this character yet. Have we stolen anything yet? Uh, first of all, the important thing. Um, uh, finance paid. Items stolen. I've only stolen one thing. I've assaulted ten people. I haven't murdered them though. Just assaulted ten people and stole one thing. <laughs> wow, how have I assaulted so many people? That's a lot. Like one per level. Uh, keep going, with Magica. What? I can't do harsh lessons yet. No, I'm I'm so bad at magic. All right. Uh, fire spells reduce the fire resistance of their targets by 20%. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's okay. That doesn't scale, that doesn't look like it scales very well. Yeah. All right, so this one, we can go either to the Dead Man's Drink or there's another one too. Uh, the Barracks. You're going to have the men around here I'm gonna have. I already do have the men around here wrapped around my fingers. Real life, too. A strong drink will chase off that chill in the air. Alright, so in here, we have to find. A bup a bup a. No, it just says it's in here. So it's probably like a journal or a book. At some point, we should hire Tekla on here. If she could just spend less time serving Dengir. Ah, I wish I could. Oh, afford if you to know what I mean. Money. I really do. Is that you? Nords arise? I don't think so. No. There it is, right here. So this is where it is inside of here. So inside Dead Man's Drink, inside this room, it's a mysterious altar, and this is a throwback from Morrowind, I believe. Travel to the roadside ruins. 
Oh no, the ataxia has cursed me with sleeplessness. Worse yet, the disease has progressed to a point that I fear I will not live to see the outcome of my choice. Don't worry, we'll live to see the outcome of your choice. Alright. Uh, in my travels, I've heard strange tales about hag ravens performing rituals near Falkreath. At the inn, I found a journal that detailed the existence of a mysterious altar that grants one of three wishes. So, obviously, we I'd wish for more wishes. If you'd take me on one of and if that doesn't work, what do you guys want to wish for? Not much At least he just says money. Here. You're as like as not more pockets. More carry space. Alright, where are you at? Roadside ruins. Oh. Are you, like, super close? Yeah, close enough. A hot dog! You don't even, you don't even want a polished dog? I swear that you were there when we started calling the uh, Polish dogs Polish dogs, and we thought it was the funniest fucking thing in the world. I mean, good for you for getting out way faster than anyone else, but <laughs> but you missed up on the Polish dogs. No, I mean, what's he missing out on, though? Love you, Zoe. Oh, yeah, oh. Oh, yeah, Irish deaths. Maybe after my soda, I'll have a barley soda. <laughs> Just one, though. Not even a chicken bake? It's churros? I think hag ravens will rip mine. Oh no, I'm a. Uh, I'm. I like. Uh, I think I'm immune to fire. Immune to speaking good English. Uh huh. Bandit. Two bucks, we take those. We take those two bucks. Oh. Uh -oh. What? Aren't you a tree? It's supposed to hurt you. Get out of here. This thing's kicking my ass. What a jerk. Fire arrows? That reminds me. <laughs> that reminds me of a game that someone's playing. I just remember wishing for a hot dog earlier today. You have multiple wishes? And I mean, if you already w got a hot dog, there's no point in wishing for more wishes if you've already got everything you need. Is it in the. Like, what rule does it say you can't wish for more w wishes? Oh, okay. <laughs> the rules. As long as there's no more trees in here, we're all we're all good. When I fall asleep, I fall asleep sideways on my bed, holding my shield. What do you want, your phone? Is there anything else you need, my dear? I was talking to chat. Alright, uh... Choose a bull at the altar. Okay, so fortune, power, nothing. Okay, who? Wait, what does? What? All right, hold on, hold on. We save. Yeah, you just wish for a hot dog. Oh man, how quick do you think you'd get sick of your seat superpower if your superpower was just whatever you wanted a hot dog, you could have one. Like you just thought and you had a hot dog appear. Like, yeah, how long? Man, I think I think I could go for a while with it. All right, so I just saved. Return to town. What? Well, I don't want to choose nothing and then, like, have to come back and do this. All right, hold on. I'm not choosing nothing. I'm way greedier than that. Never. <laughs> Never. Ever. I will eat infinite hot dogs till the day I pass. Alright, so what were the other two options? Fortune or power? Well, I mean, if you're rich enough, you can be po you can get power. I can I already have nothing. I'm not gonna get that. I have <laughs> what, what do you think? Fortune or power? Fortune, then we could. Yeah, but you can get money. You can get money in this. Who? 
I have no idea. I think I'm here with power. Alright, fill it with a little bit of my blood. Oh, I died. <laughs> I lose. I lost Skyrim finally. The pit. I can exit the dungeon or I can just search for more information. Hello. Wait, am I naked? First of all, we sure as hell aren't going to be wearing these things that they gave us. Dude, you can just like leave whenever you want. I'm moving north, so I have to say goodbye to our old Costco. Oh, that's unfortunate, man. Yeah. All right. So it looks like they're locked up. Making new memories at a new Costco without Kyle doesn't feel right. Without Cly. Get out of here. I just started. All right. So I don't want to get this guy. I bet you that's what my mom wanted to tell us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sorry, mom. <laughs> All right, so I don't think I can roast these guys through. That's insane. Just found out that my grandma is a. Uh... Oh, I can't get up on these. Oh, there we go. Get out of here, dude. There we go. <laughs> get up here, loser. Oh, I didn't know there's people up there watching. Yeah, my grandma's making like a uh, little like uh, college account for our little baby girl. Super nice. 
Nicer than I'm being to these saber cats. Am I hitting them? Oh, I'll use my highborn. There we go. I've got no shame. Beat the champion. By Ismir, you won't leave here alive. Uh, by Ismir, I think I will be. Uh, can you please step around this corner, ma'am? Thank you. Uh, Skyrim belongs to the north. That's racist. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Please stand still. Uh, ma'am. Eric, can I go? Are you not entertained? Optional take the champion's treasures? Like, oh, I'm gonna go do all this work. Hey, hey Jim Bob. Look, look, look at this fucking cat. God damn, I'm. Tell you what, you start a little Never see this. Never see this cat before, Jim Bob. Jin Bob. Where are you? you better ever rode the bus before. Oh, it's a. Must be someone there. Oh, it was a uh, a guy that Kyle's dad. Ooh, I've been, that Kyle's dad knew, and he would call Kyle's dad Jim Bob all the time, and he'd say it like that, and it was the funniest thing I'd ever heard in my life. What is this thing? Oh, oh, it's bone bolt armor. And we deserve a beer. Come back here. There you are. Count on your coins. Yeah. Say that. She called it. <laughs> spilled the beans. Like, in the good. And I mean, in a good, fine way, but it sounded like my mom really wanted to say it. Andrew, why? What? There you are. Uh, not really. Yeah, I can't really get them from, uh... Oh, Captain Altman, Raiden, hey, Dan, how's it going? We... are in the middle of a pit fight. We've got the but the bitter cup. Is there a way for me to get out of here? Ah. Let's get out of here. It might be ground rim Skyrim lesser known <laughs> Hey the the panda corn, how's it going? <laughs> yeah, these are all the uh, extra quests that are on uh, that you get from the Creation Club. We are doing Bitter Cup. Speaking of, can't I on the Bitter Cup. This cup has passed through many hands and has brought out the best and the worst in those who invite in it. Drink its nectar and it will do the same for you. So I think this, what it sh or what it used to do, if you drank from the cup, it like increased one of your stats and then decreased one of your stats by the same amount. Permanent increase the greater of health, magicka, or stamina. So this would decrease our stamina by 20. But increase our magicka by 20? You cannot eat quest items. Then give it to me at the end. Is this where all my stuff is? Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Where's all my shit? They must be taking the bets. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh, a, cup, a hag handed me this cup, saying it would bring out the best and the worst in me. I wasn't sure about that part, but I do like 
shiny clink, so I took it off her hands. Uh, besides, I think this hag was half blind and fully empty in the head. This wasn't no cup. It looks more like a trophy to me. So I got to thinking, uh, being the idea guy that I am, if some pit dogs go through all troubles of becoming champion, we should give them this cup with a ceremony and a feast and such. How many pages is this? Eh, we can get the rest of it. <laughs> How, how's the, uh, the insanely hard Skyrim going? Pit boss, he went down pretty quick. Close the door. <laughs> this is my stuff. Perfect. The danger comments now, though. Uh, head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Yeah. Then in a ring, yeah. We don't really cast a lot of illusion spells though. Race level 10 as a mage and got Jizargo as a follower. Oh, nice. You didn't die as much as last time. That's good. That one looks really hard. How long did it take for you to get to level 10? Because, like, we just got there too. All right. You Over can't here. hide from me. You're too nothing. No. There we go. Perfect. And yeah, thanks for the raid, man. Welcome, everybody. Oh, man. I don't want to look through a pile of people. Nah, I'm not going to look through that pile of people. <laughs> Like we need anything else from here. Not long, you quickly level up on oh yeah, that's right, the training dummies. That's right. I don't know why I always, like, I think, did that get added into this, too? I mean, it makes sense. It should, like, raise you up to, like, uh, like, I don't know, like a 30 or something in it. You can learn something. Boom. Can I drink this quest item? All right, so now... Did my health go up and then my magic just go down? Bitter cup, you crazy. You son of a bitch. All right, so that one's bitter cup. All right, and there's one more in Falkreath that we can go to. Oh, enemies are nearby, somebody. Uh, oh, my buddies, my buddies, get out of here. My bony boys. Oh, I should put some points into some conjuration. At least get my rats out. All right, Falkreath, please. Yeah, I've, I looked up a bunch of the quests that I couldn't figure out last time, and then a, a few of the new ones, and then a few houses. Next level, we could get the, like, Blood Chill Manor. That's the one Lacey wanted. But that guy, like, killed me probably eight times. I had to cheese that one, too. That was the no money challenge. All right. I wonder, okay, what would have happened then? We chose nothing and then came here. Would we just literally have just done nothing? I kind of want to check it out, but I think that would just piss me off. All right, we got to find the barracks. Oh, look at that. Look at that. 
Lurking for a bit, make food? Oh yeah, no problem, man. Absolutely. I get it. I end up lurking on uh, your guys' streams a lot just because, like, watching the kid, you know? Uh... No, I think this is the guy that... Yeah, it's not that. Oh, there it is. Once a hunter. Okay. Kill him. Oh, I mean... We can do that. Alright, at the barracks at Falkreath, I found information impl implicating a hunter to the south of... A uh, hunter to the south of... Implicating him of what? Uh, of the Sunderstone Gorge. Apparently in another life, he was a notorious bandit. I should investigate the camps in the area and see what I can find. All right. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I get a, a, a... More than a few people have told... Oh, yeah, we can just go to Hendrahheim. We definitely didn't murder anyone for this house. We have committed zero murders in this game. But yeah, I get a lot of people that tell me that I make good uh, background noise. Because I don't, like, scream a lot or anything like that. Nice and nice and boring for the background. I mean, you're probably lurking now. I should have asked you what you're making. Making bacon. Man, I, uh, I think I like Hendraheim as my favorite house. But I do want to check out the new ones, too. Where's that lady's body? I mean, what, what body? Alright, where's this at? Bandit. No, I'll just... it'll it'll have a path from the road. <sighs> oh, you little shit! <laughs> I was just gonna let you go on your way. I was gonna let you go on your way. But we have a 100% fire resist, so... I'm not sure how much of that was actually getting through. Witch, witch, she's a witch. Alright, get over here. Fire salts. Uh, fire salts, if you are playing survival mode, uh, and you need to make warm food, you need to have fire salts. Make sure to hoard those up a little bit. I just got the house. Hendraheim? Yeah, it's my favorite one. Uh, I, mean, I haven't seen them all yet, and there are a few ha ha new houses that I've had a chance to check out yet. We'll do that after this. Three. What are you, a ranger? No! Why, like, this is what they need to fix in Skyrim. Like, this guy's running up to me point blank to shoot me. Like, pull out, pull out some weapons, do something else, or back up a little bit. the armor. Oh, did we just get some, uh, maybe a little bit of free armor? Oh, Ripperu Arena fan. I didn't choose to be alone. Alright. I'm no stranger to solitude. I've spent years relying on no one save myself. So edgy. But it seems at the end of the day, I'm still that boy at the orphanage, parked at the windowsill, staring out into an empty street. So brooding. I think one of these books starts a quest, but I think it's the first one. Oh man, that was really that was really fast. Man, I don't want to... Why why is this stealing? It was a bandit. It was a quest. Don't, go kill this guy, but don't touch his shit. <laughs> that's his, that's over the line. It's not yours. Don't touch his stuff. Alright. 
And, oh yeah, for everybody that is new, uh, this is a new quest right here. This is a couple of new quests. Like, this little area right here is a good spot uh, to get some of the new quests done if you guys are doing the Creation Club stuff. And I highly recommend getting Hedraheim. That one so far is my favorite. Right now, we're doing uh, Murwatch. I'm going to call it Murwatch instead of Meyerwatch. And the Runoff Caverns are for a big, long set of quests. Uh, and multiple in there, too. So, yeah, make sure to check those out. Uh, we did it on our... Uh, this one's a good house, too, but it costs, like, eight grand or something. All right, let's get a new one. We ain't gonna do the Dawn Guard. All right, let me mark off. We did... Uh, Winter Hold. That... Let's do that one. Other side of the world. Switch it up a bit. Whoop. Winter hold. <laughs> it's worse than the murder. Yeah. Can't steal someone's baked potato. That's just insult to injury. It's like, you're really just going to come up, fry me, and then not have the decency to leave my baked potatoes alone. <laughs> Jones in over some baked potatoes. <laughs> All right, and this one's in the frozen heart, which is to serve these. My job is to serve the y'all. I'm sorry. Could you describe? I don't really know anyone at the college. I guess everyone just assumes I do because I'm a Dunmer. Then exploded. What did just you say the. I mean. Let me beg a drink from you yet? He owes this What's tavern enough coin to burn it down, build it back up, then burn it down again just this, for laughs. He's had some troubles in his <laughs> life, but I can't have him drinking here without at least paying back some of the coin he owes. Go right ahead. Oh, uh, what if I talk to him? He just might be sober enough to listen to you. Just might be. Until next time. Well, I'm not here to get this guy to pay his bill, so... <laughs> that's on you guys. Um... And now we're looking for a journal. Yeah. Boom. Luckily, we've hired. Discover. Wait, is this stealing? Probably. I understand Courier has been complaining about our customers again. What of it? It's ours. Does oh, she poop her pants in her sleep? They cause him no harm. Oh, I believe he was suggesting My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. Well, then he's welcome to eat and drink at home. Okay, isn't he? cool, 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 cool. That's cool. I didn't ask. All right. So, new quest. Ah, uh, the sanctuary and the manufactory. <clears throat> I have discovered the journal of an Argonian name named Seats Ancient Artifacts. I wonder what he does for a living. It details an expedition to Skyrim to find a lost Dwemer Sanctuary. Uh, <laughs> if I travel to Frostfoot Cave, I might be able to pick up their trail. Yeah, let's do it. Pop on down our little safety save, because we don't trust this game. Alright, so we should be able to go through... Cave on the other side of the road. It's like perfectly gonna be halfway through, yeah. Well, hello everyone. <laughs> we got a bit of a jog on our hands. That's all right. I don't mind it. I, one of the good things about like the no fast traveling, no spending money, was that we did have to like run everywhere, and it did give me a little bit more time to like talk with you guys. So yeah, a little bit of a silver lining. Oh man, it's gonna be a hike. I don't know why that, something sounded really weird, I can't explain it, probably nothing. Oh, I don't think I have any like soup or anything, that would have been good for this Nice long run. <laughs> Thanks, Tiny Tim. Uh, I mean, this 
looks about right. And this uh, Kinsgrove looks or sounds familiar for the new quest, but I cannot confirm that. So we'll go. So we'll just go move on. Some special talks. Getting our story straight. All right, you find a bee, you pop that bee in your mouth. All right, mammoths. They're pissed. What are they fight? Oh, they're fighting zombies. You know, the, the classic RPG trope. Mammoths versus zombies. Oh, they're getting their shit kicked in. Bap! <laughs> classic RPG trope. Haunted Cemetery. Oh, I really don't need wolf pelts. I'll try to quit him. If I remember. <laughs> I was like, I thought this guy was a hunter. He is. What are you? What are you shooting that box? I love a challenge. What was that? Oh, you suck, dude. Get it. Oh god, there's another one. That one scared me. Man, how hungry would you have to be to eat this thing? Oh, I bet you it's like it's probably like super. Muscular and tough, yeah. Ugh. Yeah, we're mean to fire. Alright, off to Nigga There's also a new house we can get to. I do want to get to that new house at some point today. I guess it depends how how big this if quest you know is. Truce, Most of the silver to I don't have them. Uh, most of the quests that I've found in Creation Club, uh, especially the item ones, are pretty, like, bare bones. But this one, like this group of quests right here, super good, super good. Like, actually challenging, super good quests. Well done to the, those creators. Alright, how am I looking? Oh, my God. I don't want to run. Just play the game for me, Skyrim. Just like hanging out, being best little friends. Uh, I think it's kicking my ass. All right. That thing was absolutely kicking my ass. I'll keep it on flames. Eventually we'll do like uh go this way. Wait, is this right? Let's look at the map. I mean it can be. It, 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 it could be sorta of right. Right adjacent. Correct ish. Stony Creek 
cave. That sounds nice and quaint. Stony Creek. Uh, I feel like, yeah, there's gotta be, uh, maybe it's more up this way. I don't know. We'll find it. Worst comes to worst, we Skyrim climb up to it. Todd Howard, Howard gave us the power to climb up mountain cliffs. We use it. Alright, it's going fine. It's going fine. Probably gonna get like halfway up here and then not be able to find my way back up. No, 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 we got this. Easy. GG, easy. Got ourselves on the glacier. I wonder what the real way to, like, we're supposed to be getting up here is. Oh, we, we might hit a, uh, we might hit a thousand views this stream. Not for the stream itself, a thousand live views total. If we don't hit it today, we'll hit it next time. God, now I gotta do something for you, little turds. I, I, Lacey said you can start by <laughs> retiring of calling them turds. We'll think, I'll think about it. You guys might get graduated up to goons. This is exactly how this game was meant to be played, and you cannot convince me otherwise. Say, I don't think this is that steep, but it's all relative, huh? Oh, there it is! You asshole, let me up there! Yes! Yes, yes! Almost there, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. There's Frostroot Cave. There's where we're supposed to go in. Where, how the hell were we supposed to get, like, actually supposed to get here? Yeah, and our quest is through that cave, but I... But, yeah, how the hell are we actually supposed to get up here? Oh, this way. Whoops. Alright, we'll pop into this place afterwards. I don't know, is that a... I don't know if that's a creation club uh, add-on or not. Hey, little one. That was your little nap in your little bottle. When daddy takes a bottle nap, it's something different when you take one. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. And Dwarven ruins are a super good place to get our... Man, I feel like we fight a lot of bandits. There's like more bandits in the population than there are like just citizens and farmers and lawyers and doctors. And cobblers and fishmongers. What do you guys think would be your like old-timey profession? If you have to li live back in like... Lacey, Lacey says she's going to be the village witch. So that one's already taken. <coughs> Excuse me.
Ekans, yeah, this. Uh, yeah, that's insane. But she gave uh, all of the grandkids that much for for like going to college. At least I think I, she gave me that much. FBI. <laughs> Uh, yeah, bacha. I don't. Well, it it will it'll be something different because it's great grandma. How do you guys how do you guys say great how do you guys great say great grandpa in Japanese? Wait, which way did I come in? Open. Like, look at these three. Just standing around. No huh? Obviously, it's no good. <gasps> Sorry, sir. 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 Thank you. Watch this, and she's like, "I, th I only saw the four thousand art in my account." Like, well, Daddy needed some. <laughs> well, Daddy needed some scratchers. All or nothing, baby. Let it ride. That room sucked. Bless you. I mean, Gravedigger would be pretty, like, you know, everyone was always dying back in the day. <laughs> Seems like you'd always have a job lined up ready for you. I guess, like, if your job was, like, the town... Where's that rack? I'm just like, if you're, like, the town executioner used to uh, be kind of, like, taboo and, like, wasn't allowed, like, in churches and stuff. It's like, what, like... You're gonna take this job, chop people's heads off, and then like be. I mean, I guess if you just want to be left alone all the time, that's the job for you. <laughs> well, that was not a rat. <laughs> Speaking of rats, hold on. I, I haven't done a disease check in a while. <laughs> Alright, we're good. Yeah, hey, everyone. We are doing new creation club quests for all the new friends out there. What level are you? Hey, Nate. How's it going, man? Uh, just got to level 11? Yeah, okay. Halfway through level 11. And we are doing this new quest right here at the at, at this place. Manufactory. This place has too many doors. <laughs> so lost. Okay, um... Let's go back. And then we'll follow the... Uh, yeah, we'll follow the left wall. Nice little pond. Could have been like a like a bathroom, a literal bathroom. Oh, there's more area over there. Terminator, I want them coming over dressed like me, and throwing fire out of their hands. But I'll never call one unless the rats get this big. Uh, 
Dwarven Spider Renovator. Let's check the room out before I renovate a Dwarven Spider. Perfect. Alright, cool room, cool room. <laughs> Alright, let's go renovate a uh, Dwarven Spider. What do you need from me? Just yank on this. The lever is currently inactive. Well, what if I do that? Uh, no, will you just give me a Coors Light, though, please? <laughs> yeah, Lacey just offered me your Irish death, Snake. <laughs> she told me to F off. Right in front of the baby. Yeah, his mommy's funny. Alright, where the hell am I? <laughs> and then I couldn't get through this way because of there was a collapse. But can I now? No, it's like still collapsed. But I want to see what's in that room. Alright, let's go to the next area. Oh, we're going down, down. Oh, thank you, hun. Yeah, we're all out of real beers again. Chug this one first. I must have had about 13 Dr. Peppers. Explore the manufactory. That is a quest right there. It's just like, go have fun. See what kind of mess you can get yourself in. Oh, babe, please. Thank you. What a gem. Oh, he's already busted. Oh, there, I think I, is, oh, there's a live one over there. Mr. Slammy McChoppy Hands. I, th I think they're, um, they, they have fire resist, don't they? I'm like 40% sure they have fire resist. I already ate one of those. See, th this is why I like, uh, the, I mean, Dwarven Ruins are kind of rough for mages sometimes, but they are good spots for uh, soul gems. That one. Oh, I was like, wait, what the hell? I ate some oil for no reason. Uh, okay. Want me to do anything else in here? Alright. That's okay, I'll just take a room that's like a little treasure room. In the, the east wing. Oh, so kind of similar. Kind of similar. It's going to have another... Oh, no. This one has a statue of a uh, crab. Or the spider. And it has a core on it. The other way didn't have a... Little bonus room. Nope. Little breakfast nook. Alright, so there's another core if, if I need it. Is anything gonna try to stop me? I'm just allowed to do whatever I want in this place? Dwemer runes are the worst I hate. Yeah, uh, if you're doing a mage build, the Dwemer runes are rough. <laughs> Especially if, if you go in at like a low level too, it, like you run out of magic and you're fighting like multiple an actuator. Wait, do I need this? I've never seen this before. I know where to find it. Nope. 
not gonna let me have it. Like you can, you can see it, but you just can't quite reach it. Alright, so in that one room that we saw, uh, there was the the, uh, the big dude statue, the Centurions. So what do you think? This is probably gonna poop out a poop out a couple of guys for us to fight. Uh, a core. Uh, usually I put pours into there and then stuff will happen. Curious. It's like not even interactable. Alright, let's go see what they want from me. What do you want from me? Ah. How is all the stuff still running? Where are the people? Well, uh, they're dwarves. And they're all gone. They disappeared. Explain. I got to explain the corpse. Hey, listen, corpse. I didn't. We, we don't have to tell you this. Oh, here we go. Here's how we're going to be. Uh... Oh, man. Puzzles. Oh, my God. I did need an actuator. All right, all right. Assembly line constructs. Collect uh, Dwemer actuators for the manufactory. Uh, according to my research, Dur Duramax con uh, constructs were meant to clean and organize the living space. Chlorgic was creative but messy. His thoughts a scramble that only uh, Duramax understood. While the Saturion and Sphere assembly lines are damaged beyond repair, the Spider construct can thankfully do the same work, albeit at a slower pace. Uh, the assembly line can be powered by placing a dynamo in the actuator, which should provide the energy required to build the construct. Once the construct is built, I'll need to activate the, le the levers in the house to have it renovate various sections of the home. By my calculations, each section should take uh, no longer than a day to finish. Is this a house? All right, and then actuator. All right, so they said the spider one still works. And the spider one was over this way. Yeah. Uh, dynamo core, actuator. I can't interact with that, so it's probably this thing in the center. I really didn't know. I really just glanced over the fact that this person was dead, and their tail's still kind of moving. Uh, yeah, the dwarves disappeared. It's uh, in the book called The Disappearance of the Dwarves. That's somewhere in this game. Ah, oh, shit, what was I looking at? I already read this one, right? And this this Kolb and the Dragon, I looked at this like, oh, it's worth two bucks. Like, what happened to it? This is a choose-your-own-adventure book that we're going to do someday. Uh... Oh, there it is. I was like, what? where is this, guys? Okay. Uh, collect Dwemer cogs. Oh, my God. We need so much shit. All right, let's get the cogs out of the way. Summon the, sp the sphere overseer. Well, I want to do everything at once. And there's three cogs in here.
Now, why? Well, you're gonna have to just play a little bit of Morrowind and figure that out. <laughs> Uh, sir? Can I do all of these? No, I just, I just do one. Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Yeah, I've seen where it goes. Uh, you went to the dead end? Oh, so he's just going to go and do his shit. All right, and then we get to just turn this area on. One, two, three, button. Construct a dwarven spider renovator. What do these words mean? Oh, that's so good. Yeah. Oh, OK. There goes the core, and then I can slap this down. Uh, some of the dwarves to clean a section of the base. Hey, you. What? Where'd he go? He just disappeared. What do you do now? Check manufacturing status. Checking status. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Then what does this room do then? Probably nothing, right? It probably gave me like a core. How dare you? How d The nerve of this guy. Right, what the hell do you want us to do? Oh yeah, this thing. And clean this place. All right, summon the dormant spider to clean a section of the base. So it takes it takes them a day to clean these areas. Wait, what's this spot? Was it? Was this the area of the base that I couldn't get through before? Was it, I think this was the yeah. This spot was blocked off. Man, that was a quick 24 hours. What's the worst that happens? Push the button. Uh, button? Nope. Nothing. Oh, why do I sit like such a Uber. Perfect. And that's not what using the throne means, game. Now uh, elves don't poop. Ah, no, that was a secret. if we're going to be able to like build different areas in here or if it's like pre-constructed like if we'll just have different wings all right man we might as well just Is that like a stone bench oh no i don't i can just wait then look at the chat how dare you <laughs> Yeah, in Morrowind, uh, when you join the Mage's Guild, you go to talk to, like, the Archmage, and he just, like, dismisses you. Because uh, you're like, oh, wow, I'm so, like, I'm so happy to be in the Mage's Guild. Like, what can I do? He's like, oh, oh man, why don't, why don't you go uh, investigate the disappearance of the dwarves? And you're like, disappearance of the dwarves? He's like, yeah, yeah, go, go do that. That's what you should do. Then you can be 
Summon a Dwarven Renovator. So let's summon this one over here. And then let's go check out that other section of the house that Homeboy was supposed to clean up. Yeah, it definitely wasn't this area. This spot was it in here? It was in here. Look at that. Alright, so this is just like a very elaborate house. Alright, well... I don't think there's too, too much. But I am curious about the what the rest of the house looks like. So, I... Oh, can I didn't I see a enchantment table? No, am I making this up? Oh yeah, this is like, this is for sure the... Oh yeah, more spots to plant. Yeah, this is the uh, alchemy room. Oh, I don't know, I mean... And you can have... Hold on, I know how the alphabet works. There it goes. Alright, so what was the other room we got? So that's why this place had so many doors. I was like, I'm getting lost in this. Man, when he cleaned a section, he... Oh, look at you. You're doing a very good job. Dwarven renovator. Here we go. This is what, this is what Mama wanted. Let's see what kind of stuff we can disenchant. Just waiting 18 hours. Yeah, I'm probably gonna end up waiting a few days. Banded armor. Yes. Not those, though. And not that. Nah, not yet. But I will. I will. I'll do that and then make a new one. Um. to take everything and then drop off all the rest of the stuff. Yeah, thanks for everyone for being here, by the way. Pop it in, see what I'm up to. Appreciate you guys. Some, I thought I picked up some junk. Eh. Hey, you. Are you uh, are you done with the side I told you to get to? Man, this house is too big. <laughs> the urns kind of look like bitter cup. Ah, uh, is this the next section? All right, let's do. It. Just standing around, staring, like a blankless stare, or blinkless stare. <laughs> we were, uh, we were slapping it at League today. I think we only lost one game again. You nerd. <laughs> Alright, and then we summon him one more time to finish off this wing. Oh my god. What section did Old Nick and Poop do now? Alright, so here's the way in. Did you fix this area? Did this need to get fixed? I can't remember. My button does my button work yet? Nope.
Ah, oh, okay, so it did fix up like this little spot. And was this a part of it? Yeah, so, oh, this looks like the larder slash kitchen. Oh, make a little garlic bread. Best food in the game. And in real life. Alright, and then let's, uh, we'll wait one more day, see what all this looks like, and then we'll go on to the next quest. Well, right on, which, so what was this one called? That one's a hunter. Pretty cute. <laughs> we lost one and we won the other 27. Yeah, we've been killing it. Urbane's bestiary. Clean up the cobwebs. We have a little entertainment area now. What's this? Chicken. Oh, it's like falling through. That's why. I was like, why does it look so weird? Eat some chicken, take a bath. way. Yeah, I'll have to figure out how to get my camera to work on there without making everything sound so weird. So we can stream some, uh, some League for y'all. You guys can watch. Watch us be super good. I mean, this is a pretty cool house. I just don't like having to go through, like, multiple loading zones to get into my house. Is that looking here? Nope. Ignore all those dead people. They were like that when I got here. Those are the previous tenants. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's pop into here. I don't know if I've ever been inside of this. Maybe I have. I don't know. Definitely not for a while. Probably just leads to Blackreach, huh? All dwarven ruins lead to Blackreach. Now, the only thing in there were skeevers. We didn't have to fight off a bunch of, uh... bunch of the automatons. But the automatons are how we get... What the hell is this place? Oh. Uh... -huh. Touch the strange orb. Hold on, hold on. Let's check out the room first. I mean, what could literally be the worst thing that happens? We die? We, we die all the time. Let's do it. Ah. You make me puke, strange orb. Just do. 
Oh, there we go. Well, there's my answer. Oh, let's not hit any rocks on the way down. Holy. Oh. That was quite the fall. cave now. Good thing we just got all these houses. And man, we're like in a legit place. We got dumped in here, so we can't just get out of here if it's too hard. We're gonna have to fight our way out, boys. Pretty sure Falmer don't like fire. We'll be testing this out shortly. Oh man, they're still coming. Look at that. Your traps are no match for me. I'm a genius. <laughs> quite the fall down here too. What the? Where did you come from? Oh, there's hella there's so many of them. All right. Hold on. Hey, honey. Oh, there's. I don't know who burned all these people up. Oh. Wasn't me. I try to get our magic to come back a little bit. Boy, I don't have. I don't think I have any real weapons. I have like my dark dagger, with like no points into. Weapons. All right, we probably have a couple mana. Yeah, magic. Boom. All right. Yeah, that's fine. Did they give up? They just said we had enough. We scared that lady off. I did run pretty far. Pretty fair. Up in there. I don't think we are too sneaky in our. Uh... Actually, our ring makes it a little bit. Uh... Our ring makes us a little sneakier. I forgot about that. I think they have. I can't, I can't remember if it's Marwind or Oblivion, but the Warlock ring. I think is they put that into the game now too. Sorry, someone did. One of the Creation Club kids. Uh, all right, yeah, no worries. That guy's like, don't worry, everyone. I scared her off. She won't be back around here no more. Wait, I don't think I've eaten a Falmer ear before. Let me just uh. I need a ranged spell, not this like cone. Hey, hey assholes. Boost. Hey. Alright, Gloom Lurker might be an issue. Yeah. How are you not taking any damage? Oh man, I wish I could just eat him off. Oh, 
one attack. I got a plan. Heal it going. My histkin should work because we slept for a few days. So many potions. What percent of your potions would you say you just never use but you keep in your inventory? Probably like 60 to 70. Like. I'll use. I probably won't use any of the ones that are stamina. I'll probably use the health. The disease. I won't use this. I won't use that, probably. Actually, give us 40 more health. And. off of the ledge. I don't know, I can get a little... Da -na -na. Da -na -na. Did my high barn already wear off? It looks like it did. Firestorm? It has big old hands. They're like they're like power gloves. Oh, that was cool as hell. Get out of here. Let me pop one of those. Nice. Yeah, the, uh, the gloves are part of the uh, the dragon bone armor. It's just super bulky looking. Stomach hurts. Oh, you all right? Did you eat something weird? No. All right, well, if you start not feeling good, just let me know, all right? You want to take a Tums or something? Yeah, sorry, hon. Oh. 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 And I've got it on the flames. Or on the healing. This is like with us with some pretty decent uh like armor and enchantment and stuff too. They're still like I guess it's just because we don't dish out too much damage yet. And we need it we need a new spell, let's be real. Arcing? We are we already have shock damage, I'm pretty sure.
No, nothing cool. Now I have to watch for guys popping up back behind me. Stony Creek Cave. Oh, the Stony Creek Cave is that place that we kind of saw when we came up here. Someone there? What was that? Over here. Run! Oh, does that guy have like a Daedric bow? Alright. This, you, you'll die quick. Alright. This guy's next. There we go. And then lastly, the guy with the freaking Daedric bow. Keep on moving. You keep on moving. He doesn't know where that's coming from. Alright. Ruin's Edge. Randomly amplifies one of these effects to the target. Frost, demoralize, frenzy, drain magic, or par he could have paralyzed me? And the guy likes his cheese. Yeah, look at all this cheese the homeboy has. Yeah, I thought this was like a Daedric. Oh man, ward spells, yeah. Yeah, they ain't for me. Uh, we need more, way more magic. There we go. Alright, let's... There we go. Holy. I guess that's a. Uh, yeah, that's everything. It just seems weird. And I really don't want, like, the Moonstone or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, secrets. Nope. That's speaking of RPG tropes. That's a good one. Is the secret behind the waterfall? A little secret cave or secret passage? I feel tall. You be huh? come back. What? That it? That your best? Perfect. And then her friend is just like somewhere back here. Oh, did I already kill her? Oh, never mind. I think. Yeah, she already got burned up. Never mind. Oh, still even got the bow tot. I mean, that was super cool. Good thing I'm immune to fire. <laughs> You're level 11, I feel like you're so much further ahead than I am. I mean, I've, I, like, to be fair, I've played a good amount of this game. And I, and I, uh, I do have, like, a, a thing I was follow or not a thing I was following, I looked up, like, all the new quests, too, so I didn't have too much, like, running around. And honestly, just, like, having this, like, laying on the ground somewhere, I think we found this when we were, like, level 6 or 7 or something. And it's some of like the best armor in the game, and you can just find it laying on the ground. What, bro? Well, now ain't this a surprise? Oh, oh he's. Yeah. He oh he is beating my cheeks. All right, hold on. We're gonna resist some magic. We're gonna minorly heal ourselves. And we're gonna play this game with him. God, 
God, we have to play this game a little bit more, too. Uh... And then... Let's just get... I only know two destruction spells. Bro. Rant. I mean, this thing's pretty cool, but it doesn't have any enchantments or anything. Treasure map X. I think we have two. We have seven, and then now we have ten. Treasure map X. Uh, Finn's loot, we'll take it. It feels really good to be able to have money again. <laughs> Where's the alchemy lab? Why is your alchemy lab invisible? <laughs> uh, where's restore health? There we go. Restore magic. And restore... And destruction spells are stronger. This is a good one. That's a pretty good one. We don't, I don't think we have any points. I am level four though. Oh yeah, you gotta you gotta get leveling up. I mean, you start leveling up pretty quick. The mages level up kind of slow, to be fair though. Like uh, the fightery kind of classes level up pretty quick. How the hell do I get out of here? Uh, that's the way I came, so we gotta turn around. There we go. Like, when you're fighting, you're hit, you're dealing out a lot of damage constantly. You're taking damage for your, like, uh, for your armor. The smithing's pretty easy to level up. else is, makes you level up fast? Uh, sneaking can. Yeah, mostly it's just like weapons armor level up pretty quick. Block. Eh. Block picking is kind of hard. Alchemy is alright. Enchanting can you can level up pretty quick too if you find a bunch of soul gems and then just random stuff. Like I'm not wearing something. I, I'm not have. I don't have like a shield. Uh, not gonna do the jam. Speak. Talk to Randmere about Haran. Nah. All right. What else we got? All right, I think uh, the Arcanium isn't is the is the Arcanium the library, right? Right? Yeah, it's got to be. 
It's got to be, right? Right. Yeah, wanted a beer, but sometimes all you have is Coors Light. <laughs> All right, I believe. Wait, don't you train If there are any problems, let me know. It's my job to keep things running smooth. I think the college is due for a change. I want for all you, you can see me? Yeah. Confound it all! I was quite sure I was invisible, or at least spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. All right, let's sell. Uh, scrolls, mayhem, I don't like. Magical vibrating shock that emits a tremor every eight seconds, staggering enemies and reducing magic. All right, all right. That's a lot of petty soul gems. Alright, what else you got over here? What spells? What spells you got? Interrupts target spellcaster. If a spell is interrupted, the target is hit by their own offensive spells. Alright, alright. Run, and then teleport back. That's temporary health that wears off after two seconds? Why? But oh, this is just cool. And it teleports you back. That one's crazy. Alright. Alright. All right, all right. Yeah. Well, we're definitely not an illusionist. The Mage's Guild, total nerds. I know, man. I'm sorry. All right, then we don't need that guy. All right, and oh, thank God. I wasn't sure. I was. I was very not sure. Like, oh, does it doesn't it have the word library in it? Maybe not. All right, and then the book in here. Oh, it's a journal. We, another journal we gotta find. Uh, my favorite. I don't grump. want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Oh, we there it is. I think. There we go. Creature of legend. Up. Oh, talk about. Find and tame the unicorn. So I don't need to read this book because you just saw what it's uh, what we're doing. Uh, spell tome. Telekinesis arrows. This spell tome will teach its reader the unique art of telekinesis arrow, uh, giving both a lesser power and the knowledge to craft these special arrows. Upon firing the arrow, one will find it to be suspended, frozen in the air until the telekinesis lesser power is cast. Upon which the volley is released. All right. So, I think this thing is telling me that I shoot a bunch of these suspended arrows. They stick into the air until I use the power, and then they all fly at once. Is what I'm getting from that. Very intrigued. All of the elephants. Let's go. Except we don't have a bow. I mean, we could always get one. Hey, everyone. Everyone that's popping in, saying hi. I'm working on some very important research. Why doesn't anybody want to train me? All right, so. Find and tame the unicorn. Ah, it apparently just lives right outside Riften. If 
we ever need to do some mountain climbing, now we can actually do it. Because we'll have a mount. Man, this thing is like right over here. I've been looking oh. for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Oh, it's blood chill. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Like, I know uh, you want to do like cool quests and stuff like that too, and have cool names for it. But blood chill matter is like, oh, that's a that's a that's a vampire house. Uh, Arielia. You have been cordially invited to dinner and drinks at Bloodchill Manor. As an honored guest, you are encouraged to come early and mingle with the other attendees. When you are ready to feast, ask the house waiter for a menu and he will let you into the banquet hall. Uh, the finest and most delectable dishes will be on display. There will be no need for appetizers. Once everyone is ready and seated, a full course awaits. Come for the dinner, stay for the drinks. All right, vampire. Alright, so we're not going to do that quite yet, because we got a unicorn to find. <sighs> Alright. I, 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 yeah, I didn't pick it up. Oh, I killed the fox. Uh, are these guys on my team? I'm just gonna I'm gonna take the sip. Alright, alright, they seem they seem pretty cool with me. Unless they're gonna try to attack this unicorn. Never should have Oh wait, who are they attacking now? This rat? Alright, unicorn. Unicorn. There it is. Well, that was easy. Is there just like a little city or. <laughs> hey, hey, asshole. Oh my gosh, look how much. Wild horses will be. Uh, will buck until tamed. Stay mounted until they submit. I mean, you could use that anything in life. If you are thrown, try again. Once tamed, you can add a, add a saddle and rename them at any stable. When changing horses, tamed horses will return to the location where they were found. Hell no. You stay right you stay right here. I don't have to do like a mini game or anything, like Breath of the Wild. Oh, Oh, man, I'm dead. Uh, I'd like to make a animal handling check, please. Hi, right, you little jerk. Oh, no, not yet. Oh, I just bucked Aurelia off again. Unicorn? Yeah! Got it. Yeah, Creation Club, man. It's crazy. Where'd it go? Oh. Alright, come on, dude. Video game rule. Third time's a charm. There we go. Rule of three. Look at these guys running around. They're going crazy. There it is. Horse has been successfully tamed. So now we have to get a saddle, or we can make a saddle. And I think we can get armor, right? We can get horse armor. Sweet. Let's see, how do we look? Oh man, we look majestic as hell. Look, look at, look up there, babe. 
the unicorn too. Hell yeah. <laughs> unicorn. This is a nice road. So if I... Alright, so if I... So this horse is now tamed. This unicorn is tamed. If I get off of it... You're gonna stay here, right? Okay. Can I fast travel on a horse? Because if so... We could go to Hendraheim. That actual has that has an actual stable in it. Oh, we could get the other... We could get the robot horse, too. That, that, like, the dwarven horse reminds me of, like, the... Uh, like little horses in Fallout 4, like the Giddy Up Buttercup or whatever. That's what that reminds me of. Oh, perfect. Alright, nerd, you, you live here now. Uh, can I not? Dismount. Uh oh. Oh no! Uh oh, I think I did it. Oh no. Uh oh. I think I did this last time too, to be fair. Alright. You live here now, unicorn. Oh, if you guys come up with a uh, good name for the unicorn, let me know. Because we can rename it and get it a saddle. What is that, like a uh, leather? I make my own? I know how to use it. Scout stuff. Baby cakes. Oh, we can't make it, whatever it is. I mean, we're probably not high enough level. I don't think we have any, like, perks or points or anything set into it. Got a little bit more time. Let's do one more. Did that one. Did that one. Mara's Eye Pond. Mara's Eye Pond. I think that's somewhere around in here, but I haven't discovered it. Well, let me check the old uh, handy dandy notebook. <laughs> Did I mean that? I sure did. Alright. Oh, okay. Oh, alright. It's like right... Like over in here somewhere. I think it's like somewhere like right in here. Let's, uh... What does this one do? There's a few like pets that we can do as well too. There's more houses. We got so much to do. And then there's like a quest that you get at like level 30, like 46 or something. There's one that you get at like 32. Like I'd like to see those, but uh, it's quite the grind. Oh, and my favorite song is playing. I think it's somewhere right around in here. Where's a little more south? I already closed the window. I'll only, only I'll only do a little bit of cheating. I think it's south.
And I think the reason why they call it that... Actually, I wonder... Because it actually looks like an eye, so this might be it. It's supposedly, it's supposed to look like an eyeball. So, maybe it's this. The de I mean, the detail on this isn't going to be awesome. Old fishing spot. We haven't done too much fishing either. We did a. L the fishing's just like kind of lackluster. Like you don't even like, like reel in. You don't even choose where you cast. It's just kind of like they just do it for you. Push A. Yeah, I thought what like maybe one of these like heat springs was gonna be like Morrow's Eye Pond, because from spa from space. From above, it'll look like an eyeball. Yeah. And a bear's gonna eat me. Wait, where is it? Down hanging out at the crab shack. Oh, I think there it is right there. I was gonna say, like, I feel like I run into this thing all the time, but I don't know exactly where that is. I got the side of the world right. <laughs> hey, man. Man, I, yeah, I feel like I just do. I should have got some destruction spells to do that one. That gives us some. Yeah, I feel like I'm just doing nothing to these bears. Magic and recovery point. And I think I do have to use these. I wanted to save them a little more, but bears just beat me up. There, now it. Oh, do those stack? They can't stack. They can't do that. They can't stack. Probably been a while since I saved, huh? Alright, Mara's eye pond. Where's my Where's my letter? Say. Yeah, it's yeah, there's supposed to be a, a oh, can't uh can't cast fire spells in the Shit, there's another little one. I, I, I didn't know that there was more one, than one place to grab them. Oh man, we're gonna have like a nice little aquarium going. There we go. It didn't say if it was in drugs. <laughs> I do. I have a, I have a little bit of drugs on on me. But I need it to make my uh, elsewhere fondue. Eating a 
giant tail though. Oops. Hawk pea. Delicious. Oh, yeah, I know that. Grapes. Never had a grape before. I'm not eating this. I love him or her. In college, I used to have a uh, oh, the little the little crabs, the uh, uh, hermit crab. They love to party. That person over there just beating their drum. All right, let's roast these nerds. Oh, it's vampires! Finally, my fire's gonna do something. Oh, I did not see that one on the other side. Roast them. Toast them. Fry them up nice. Blood, that ain't the one. I think it's a journal. There we go. All right. Now that's a moral blood. Yeah, let's just eat some, <laughs> eat some cave cabbage real quick. I mean, if you're into light armor. <laughs> Take the garlic. Can I reach this? Oh shit, has it been right here the whole time? Nope. Bodies! That bastard has me moving bodies! Well, I stripped them of their jewels and gold, so now the joke's on him. Very uh, journaly over here. Maybe, uh, maybe somewhere down here. Oh my God! I don't want your beacon, lady. it on there. I didn't see it on the table. I don't think I blasted it. Yeah, so maybe outside sitting somewhere? Yeah, I don't see it anywhere on here. Yeah, we ain't touching that beacon. Like, where else would it be? I mean... Like, this is literally the only other place that's even close by over here. I'll pop in real quick, and if I can't find it, uh, I'll just look it up while I'm... Ever, before each stream. I get out of it, I look up like where the quest, like the name of it, like where they start, and like what I gotta do to start it. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Is this a house? It is. Hooded skeleton. 
There we go. Dreams of the dead. Uh, read the Ark Necro Necromancer's first clue. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Uh, my old master was a collector of things, skeletons, staves, and priceless artifacts. The most prized of which uh, were the helm and staff of Manny Marco himself, the King of Worms. I think Manny Marco's in oblivion. Pretty sure. The old master was also a collector of uh, apprentices, which in our trade are even more dangerous than the artifacts. He was aware of my ambition and where it would end. I, he knew I would steal his artifacts and kill anyone who stood my way, himself included. So like any good necromancer would do, he made sure his trap would ensnare uh, me even beyond the grave. The doors are blocked by some kind of invisible ward, but there must be a way to remove it. The master was nothing if not circumspect, and he would have left himself in out where he would have fall victim to his own trap. Makes sense. In fact, I think he aimed to make a game of it. His final words to me were, start with the map. I tried to make sense of the clue, and I have made some progress. The flags seem to represent the torches. I just have to remove the right ones. Get out of my head! Let me out! Open the door. Oh, this place might be a little haunted. What do you guys think? Alright, start with the map. Ark Necromancer's first clue. Pick up the torches that trace the mage's path. Oh, I mean, don't say that. I want to, like... I want to, like, do that on my own game. Ah. Alright, well... This is obviously going to be a... Yes. I, want the, I want the Staff of Worms, please. Uh... Oh, I thought I heard somebody come. All right. Well, we're going to pick this up next time. And so, uh, yeah, Wednesday night, 6 o'clock, if you guys want to watch this on Twitch. Uh, and then I'll put this up tonight for everybody on the YouTube. Stop it. All right, but uh, thanks... Yeah, the Necromancer home. I Like, just starting it, though. But yeah, look at it. It's a little haunted, I think. Just a teeny tiny bit haunted. Yeah, all right, everyone. Well, thanks for popping in. Thanks, Captain Oltman. Thanks for Nate. Thanks for Urgent Sandwich. And thanks for the raid, man. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I'll be back again a couple of days. Uh, otherwise, y'all take it easy. Have a good one. And uh, see you then. Alright, y'all take care.